So I've been asked to show you the Windows 7 view or look for Parallels Desktop 9. Now what this is, it's a way of changing the uh, modern user interface in Windows 8 or 8.1 to a more traditional start menu and also to change the way that uh, full screen apps work. So to show you what I mean, let's jump into our Windows 8 machine. Now this is actually a Windows 8.1, the release to manufacturing edition, but it, it works exactly the same way. So Normally what we have is our traditional, um, well I say traditional, it's the modern user interface which is the full screen start menu and also firing up some of the modern UI apps for example like uh, the weather, it gives you that full screen view. Okay. Now what we can do with Parallels is we can change that view. So up on the view menu at the top here we have the option to use the Windows 7 look. So what I'm going to do is select that. And it's going to make some changes. Now, the first time you do it, it will go off and install a couple of applications. Um, for those that are interested, it's the Start 8 application from Stardoc, I think it is. So let's have a look at the changes that, are, that it makes. Well, the first thing and the most fundamental change that it makes is it adds your traditional start menu back to Windows 8 or Windows 8.1. So as you can see down there, I have a, a Windows 7 look um, start menu. So again the search works in exactly the same way um, it's just not as it doesn't have that intrusive modern interface or modern UI. Okay you can still get to the modern UI so at the top there we have our Windows 8 menu so hitting that produces the normal menu that we know from uh, know and love of course from Windows 8 and 8.1. The other change that it can make is it can change the way that full screen apps work. So let's pop into our Windows 8 menu and again we'll select the weather app. This time you'll see that it's actually a window on my desktop so again it's a more traditional um, way of presenting apps rather than the full screen method that you would know and love with Windows 8. So it is pretty straightforward um, it's very easy to switch between the two so at the minute I'm, I'm on the Windows 7 look if I wanted to change back to the Windows 8 or 8.1 feel all I have to do is deselect the option on the menu and what it will do is I think it will log me out log me back in again there you go so when you log in again Windows 8 will have its initial design so you can see that at the top there so I'll say yes should log us out There we go, if I sign back in, what we should have now is our traditional, um, well, I say traditional, the, the modern UI interface back. Okay, so um, anyway, I hope you found that useful.